Somehow we got out of that war with both the Congo and the Norwegians. So uh, I'm feeling pretty good about this, but at the same time, I know that in the future, probably somebody will declare war on me again because uh, I'm just not going to build a military. I mean, I already have a military, but I mean, I'm not going to continue to, to invest in more and more units. If anything, at the very least, what I'll continue to do is build ancient walls, build the Renaissance walls, um, and build encampments just for that extra strike. But that's about it. That's about it. I don't want to waste any more production on anything else. So I'm trying to go after this barbarian settler. We're also building a settler inside of this city here, which this city is going to be at seven population. Obviously, it's going to go down to, it's going to go back down to six, but not a big deal. No, 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 buddy. No, no, no. I'm going to take care of this encampment for England because Vicky's just having so many issues. She just cannot, she can't take it down. She cannot take it down. It's, it's been the saddest thing. So, uh, yeah, that's, that's been happening. Um, I need to, I need to improve this amenity as quickly as possible because that has not been happening and I needed to get out at least one more builder while I have this awesome, uh, extra build enacted. You do need some more districts too, my man. Well, you need the walls as well, but let's go with a builder for now. Yeah, let's go with a builder for now because I'm sure this city could use uh, a few extra things under its belt. I should leave you alone. This city needs walls, like, really, really badly. Um, okay, I'm gonna chase you down and kill you. Wow, England. Wow. Oh, man, that is that is just insane, that what they're dealing with right there. Okay, good. So, I, I stole that away. We're going after another barbarian encampment before they come over here and pillage my campus. I didn't think about that. Like, this is a great campus to have because it's getting, you know, huge, huge adjacency bonuses. But, um... You know, barbarians could just come over here and pillage it, like, whenever they want, so that that's kind of a problem. Yeah, that is that is kind of a big problem. Okay, so clearly Japan is somewhat of a threat to our, to our empire. Now, America didn't get mad at the Congo when they declared war on me because uh, they weren't a part of, you know, the Congo aren't on the same continent as America. So, that is part of it, I guess. Um, I'm trying to declare a friendship, but they're just not interested. I don't know what's up with that. Big stick, stick policy. He likes peaceful civilizations. That's me that have a city on his home continent. Oh, that have just one city. Okay. Hate civilizations that start wars against a city-state or civilizations based on his... Yeah, okay. Well, just be nice to me, Teddy, please. I've killed you multiple times in other series, but please, I'm asking you to, to not return the favor. You build your empire as the rising sun, powerful and brilliant. Cool. Very happy that you like me, my dude. I, I promised that I was going to move some units away from him in the last video. I'm concerned that he's going to be upset that I just have one crossbowman here. <laughs> I'm hoping that that will not be the case. Okay, so here we go. We're going to repair you. And we're in a much better situation now. Um, so this settler might as well just come here and settle. So that's, that's what I think we'll do. Man, England's been trying so long to get out of Settler. It's so sad. I'll create an escort mission. We did just repair this wine resource. I'm going to want to improve the silver as quickly as possible. So getting enough gold to purchase those tiles will be pretty important. I think we want... You know what? No, no, no. We're not going to do that. We are not going to do that. I should look at wonders. I still haven't built any wonders. A great merchant points. I actually don't want great merchant points. Renaissance walls... Here's a wonder diplomatic policy slot for the rest of the game. That's pretty nice. Must be built on a hill adjacent to a mountain. We have a lot of those. We have a lot of those. You know what? We actually might have a good chance of building this if we rush this technology. Man, science-wise, I suck. I am sucking science-wise. How bad is it? Um, 26 technologies... 25, 23. Okay, so I don't suck that bad, but it's going to catch up to me. I guarantee you it's going to catch up to me. So I've got to build a campus district probably in one of my two newer cities because this is not good. I also really need a trader. This is this is, this is is bad that I have not got a trader yet. But I have so many things I want to buy. Okay, so you stay there and heal. Uh, you do need to build the trader because I don't know who else I'm going to build it with. So you stop. Your amenities are sucking. What's up with that? Build the trader. And then you guys are going to make your way downtown. Walk fast. 
And then this is good too because when I send my other settler over, this will already be ready to go. So we'll have a lot of a lot of unique amenities here. We will definitely have a lot of unique amenities. So I'm assuming we shouldn't have amenity issues for the most part. Yeah, for the most part, I don't think we will. I was supposed to send this guy over here. Okay, good. So this trader is about to finish his uh, long journey to Madrid. What I will probably do, we'll, we won't have a city settled by the time this guy's done, though. I need to figure out a way. we got to build the infrastructure from Madrid to Barcelona. We can do that by sending it from this city to Barcelona, because then they'll use the same route and then just create a new road. That might be best case scenario. How many actions do you still have? You have five. Oh my gosh, you have five actions? Wait, how do you have five? Because I haven't used any. Oh, that's why. Duh. I've really just literally been repairing things. Okay, that's great. Um, let's go for the cattle then. Make sure you watch them. Yes, there's too many barbarians over here. So I'll be back. I will be back for a little bit later. So we did just get up the archaeological museum and the art museum, which would be really helpful. The enlightenment would be great to get. We have th learned or earned three great people. Okay, so let's go guilds, I guess. We can probably skip out on naval tradition completely, and I might. Uh, what is this? Production for medieval... Oh, and wonders. We actually will be going for renaissance wonder. Uh, I guess I'll go for monarchy, Just and I might. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, this is kind of the first wonder where I'm like, yeah, that would be nice. An extra diplomatic slot for the rest of the game. Okay, let's get you out of here. I might just sit this scout by... America just to kind of watch them just just kind of to see you know hey what's going on bro what is going on we have also significantly slowed down when it comes to growth just about everybody is at their housing limit and amenities aren't doing too well so yeah I think the plan for this scout will just be to sit here all game maybe not all game but for a little while on this hill so we have great vision over kind of two of the biggest threats Japan and America those are really kind of the big threats right now. Uh, I'm bringing over this archer so that we can continue to fight off these barbarians because this is just ridiculous. Of course, there's going to be a barbarian that lands here. So I don't want to attack him across the river. I'll go here first. Uh, what else are you... What else are you working that I can improve? Can I build... I can only build a mine here. I guess we'll do that because your production does need improvement. A little bit of improvement. And I would love to get an extra builder out of this, so that sounds great. So I'm going to I'm gonna go here. We will get access to... Or I can go on the southern part and grab this eventually. One, two, three. I don't want the tundra, though. Cattle, stone, and eventually silver. And I'll have to buy that. This is not a bad spot. Yeah, so I think I'll do that. We could also do some trade routes. Um, coastal trade routes. Boom. So maybe there is a reason to build a harbor. There has been a reason to build this, the harbor the entire game, actually, but uh, I haven't been doing that. And th that one reason is to open up more trade routes. Because that's really how we're going to win this game, is through trade routes. So I need to get up more trade routes for for sure. Um, yeah, so we're going to continue out this way. That's good. I'm thinking about upgrading this guy. Maybe this turn. Okay, so what happened with the spy? A spy uh, from the Empire of Congo... Capture during as oh whoa 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 well I can't do anything about it right now okay well, we'll have to wait on that trading post has been created okay good we com we completed our trading post which means now we've got to figure out I mean here's the thing I can wait actually wait a second once I settle the city I can move them to that city immediately I think that's what I might want to do let's also make this a little bit easier on ourselves. Kill this swordsman. I wonder if England is dealing... No, that this is the only encampment. Eng England just has not taken out any of these barbarians, which is ridiculous. Okay, I'll take you down now. There you go. Now, improve, improve the cattle. Now, real, real quick. Real quick. Real, real quick. There you go. Uh, go here. I think this is an okay location. Boom. Find the city. So, there's Cordoba. I want to as quickly as possible purchase this silver, if I can, and then I will attack you. We might give it some time, though. It's going to be expensive. Man, I just am not making that much money. 
I am not making as much money as I'd want. And uh, yeah, so we're going to switch this off, go to Cordoba. And then we'll do a route. And you know what? I might do a crazy route and go to Barcelona. That would take so long though, Drew. That would be... I don't know if I want to do that. Ooh. That's right. That's what I could have... That's what I'm trying to purchase. I was trying to purchase. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to purchase that. Can you move now? Can you do something with that? No. You still cannot. Hmm. I, I do need a university. Oh, and I need these things too. Great works of art. These are great works of art, but I need writing slots. What is this? Oh, extra faith? No, I don't need that. I'm looking at this guy here. However you pronounce that. Let's take the turn off to, uh, let's take, yeah, some time, time off to get out the other trader. Get this going as quickly as possible. And then you just go with the granary. Try your best. How are your initial tiles? I imagine your initial tiles are pretty good. Yes, actually they are. Cattle and marsh right next to, right next to each other. So we're going to have to live without the silver for a little bit. That's just how we are going to have to live. Um, no, my people will settle where they please. If you want to come at me, come at me, bro. Don't tase me, bro. So I'm guessing we'll go up around the river, boom, and then we'll use this infrastructure. Barcelona might take too long. I don't know if I'm going to go there. That sounds like it might just take a little bit too long to go towards. Let's see. Of course, they're all they're all ready, ready to go. Just sitting here waiting for me. That will not be an easy thing to fight through either. Ancient walls aren't super needed right here. What is is an aqueduct. But I'm thinking maybe a campus because we really do need... Oh, man, that's, that's a lot of... I just improved that too. Through extra science, I think it's kind of a big deal because I don't want to build campuses everywhere. So I want to make sure they get the biggest adjacency bonuses they can. I will... Yeah, I think I need to to build it here so let's build a campus there that's gonna take some time that is going to take some time for sure but I think it's worth it okay so I'm gonna upgrade you there we go let's get the extra housing oh no 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 do not let I'm not gonna let England take that back from me there we go okay perfect that was very weird. I wonder why he did that. I guess he knew that guy was going to die or something. I don't know. Okay, so I can go to Madrid. I can go to Barcelona. But it's going to take 18 turns. It wouldn't take too much longer. I'm pretty sure with one of our new trade routes, we'll have a better... You know, because I could go from Madrid to like, I don't know, Gifu or something like that. And it would be... He'd pass by and, and lay down just as good of a, of a road. So let's go to Madrid just to kind of get you up and running a little bit faster. And then you're going to come back towards the capital as well. And good. Okay, so can Cleo, uh, Claire, clear? I can't talk today. Scale, scale cliff walls. There you go. I can do I can do that. Man, these mountains look beautiful when the sun is setting. It is crazy. Like the shadow dynamics, the di dynamic shadows, I guess I should be saying, is really, really nice. Okay, you guys need to slow your roll. For real? These barbarians are ridiculous. I've been fighting barbarians all game long. Okay, well, at least we should be able to take this guy down. Perfect. All right, so that's what you get. We built another builder inside of Barcelona, which was really needed. I'm glad that we did that. Uh, you really desperately do need ancient walls. It's prob probably a, a industrial district, too, because you are sucking, my man. You are just not doing very good. So ancient walls for now because it's going to take... Only eight turns to build. And that's just for safety reasons. In terms of this builder, we just have one for Cordoba. We just got one for, for Cordoba. I need to make sure that this does not take 24 turns. Um, so one way to do that is probably just putting another mine down here. Actually, what I can do... We might as well just put it here. Look at this tundra tile. Whoa! This tundra tile, it is in the tundra, but it's also a hill forest tile so hill forest obviously pretty good and it makes up for the fact that it's it's a tundra that's kind of cool you didn't yeah that's uh that's something i need to keep in mind okay so yeah you're supposed to go up here i thought i had these those two linked but it's okay i'm gonna link you again we're gonna come back over this way 
Now, how much is it going to cost for me to get over here? 85, and that's probably going to be like 105, that tile far away. He's, ooh, he's likely to not grow towards the north, I don't think. He's probably, yeah, Cordoba's probably naturally going to go towards the fish. Hmm. And how about you, Barcelona? How are you doing? You need more amenities. I can see that. Improving this tile would pro is probably best case scenario. You also, I'm sure you also need housing too, right? Yeah, well, let's, let's put a lumber mill up there. And then maybe a few farms. We'll see. Okay, thank you for your help, but we don't need you anymore. Maybe come back towards the capital. I want to double check that we can't do anything with this guy. Nope. Nothing with this guy yet. I didn't realize I could just transfer him to a different city. That would have been a lot safer to just transfer this guy to Barcelona and then send him out towards that. Well, it doesn't matter. It's fine. Whoops, another encampment. Okay, so we're going to want to say, of course, for England. Of course, it pops up there. I need to take care of that one, though, because we do have spices and wine along like that area. So that'd be kind of a pretty big deal if we don't take care of it. Hmm. You know what? We might as well just have you... Yeah, do your thing first, Builder. How many action? You only have two. Well, still, that's okay. I've never, I have never captured a builder that had all three. I'm pretty sure when a barbarian steals away a builder, that probably removes an action point. I, I'm willing to bet that it does. Okay, so I'm gonna take you down and then give this guy the promotion. Yes, give him first range units. Nice. Okay, so we can enact that policy that allows us to build the wonder a little bit quicker. We want to ignore that. We probably want to go guilds. Yeah. Uh, culture to all. Oh, the Chitnitsa is nice, but I don't think I have any Rainforest tiles. We didn't really start up next to the Rainforest. Discovery, uh, yeah, we need to get this guy, even though there's no writing slots I have open yet. Yeah, I want to stick with Merchant Republic. Thank you, though. Thank you very much, though. Production towards Medieval and Renaissance Wonders. I think I'm going to do it. And I'm going to get rid of this, because I think I'm good builder-wise for now. I think for the most part, we are good builder-wise, I want to say. 15% faster growth rate on... Yeah, cities... Yeah, we did it. I want to keep this up, because now I have three of my cities are not along the capital continent. So, we might as well keep giving them that those bonuses. And we need to switch this out for great artists. Okay. Okay, so we're, we're in a much, much better situation now. Obviously, taking care of these barbarians and things like that. Boom, grab that. That's going to give you a ton of extra production, so this city should be able to pump out the campus a little bit faster. But uh, feeling pretty good about this, we're going to settle our sixth city, and that's pretty much going to be it. I am not going to settle anything else outside of six cities. I don't think this would be the right campaign to settle more than that. But, um, oh, man, the cathedral looks great. Look at that. This cathedral looks amazing. Now we need to fix the amenity issue. We need to fix the economy because the economy still kind of sucks because I'm only doing internal trade routes, which means I'm only getting like two gold per turn. That's not good. We've got to trade with somebody like America or Japan, even though that's kind of risky at the same time because we don't know if they're willing to backstab us. Anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.